Hi Libra, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the month of July 2017. Also want to remind you to check out your weekly videos as well as your daily psychic tip and tarot. If you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. And if you're seeking a psychic reading, please contact me on my website at www.ms-swamiswami.com. You'll find a link to that below these videos. Libra, it looks like you're coming into a lot of high energy for the month of July. You guys are really busy at work. I really want to stress that. But your balance is being restored. It's like you're going on a new emotional path here. You're doing things differently. And Libra, the best I can describe is you are shutting down what no longer serves a purpose in your life. And you're moving forward. Okay? Uh, for those of you that are single, there is something new coming in in the month of July, uh, going with that uh, new emotional path for you guys. And for those of you that are in a couple situation, this is kind of a strengthening of that bond. So really, you're kind of letting go and pushing forward this month. So let's take a look. This is for Libra for the month of July 2017. Libra, we start with the Five of Wands, followed by the Ace of Swords, Major Arcana of Judgment, Major Arcana of the Tower. I've seen that on a lot of the readings this month. Uh, Major Arcana of the Emperor. There is the King of Cups. So let me break this down for you guys and we'll go a little bit further. Uh, Five of Wands just shows, like I said, you guys are going to be busy. And I'm seeing you a little bit overwhelmed, okay? And a lot of the struggle is coming from juggling the personal life as well as the working career. Because like I said, it's just a busy month overall. It does look like you're under new beginnings. And you guys are really the ones that are prompting this new beginning. You're looking for change, you know? And where I'm talking about, you're closing out the past. This is where I see you passing judgment, okay? This is where the people that no longer serve a purpose to you or what you've put your energy into, you're closing out. Now, moving forward with that tower, the emperor, and the king of cups. There is a disruption of some sort. There is your temper flaring up, and it is directed probably at these people that no longer serve that purpose. This is, it's kind of like coming to the realization that this person or the people or group that you're dealing with is what has been holding you back all along, okay? So you're taking control of that. Beside that, we see the emperor. And the emperor is someone that's very dominant, uh, very controlling in your thoughts, uh, things like that. And this is actually restoring your balance, okay? So whatever disruption, whatever it is that you're closing out from the past actually puts you on the right track to where you need to be. Now, moving forward, we have the King of Swords, which is the Libra card, so you're appearing in your own reading. We have the Four of Swords, and we have a Major Arcana of Temperance. Let's keep going. We have the Major Arcana of the Wheel of Fortune, and we have the Three of Pentacles. The fact that you appear in your own card with that need for rest just kind of reiterates that your balance is being restored as you go through the month of July. Then we come into two more major arcanas, the temperance. This shows that your balance isn't completely restored, but you're taking steps to get there. The wheel of fortune is just where you're anxious. Uh, you're wanting change. You're wanting change for the better. And I promise you guys, close out that pass and it will come, okay? And then uh, the three of pentacles also indicating a little bit of financial stress around you guys. So what we're looking at this month, judgment. This is where you're judging... The, these people that you need to shut, shut away from. There is a small confrontation. There is the person that is dominant and controlling in your thoughts. It's also an unexpected offer or assistance from someone. And then we have your balance being restored. And then of course your anxiety is a little bit high, but overall, fantastic month for Libra. You're getting a lot done and it starts with closing out when no longer serves a purpose. So thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you soon. Bye.